Raider Nation, what's going on? You're watching the Raider Sport. Today's show, the main topic, Tom Brady to the Raiders. A rumor that just seems like no matter how hard I try, it just never dies. But there is a little bit of new news around this. So according to the Adam Jones podcast, Tom Brady bought property in Las Vegas. For those of you that have never heard of the Adam Jones podcast, guilty as charged. It's basically just two dudes from Boston who just talk it up, chop it up a little bit. Now, they go on to say that everyone around town is talking about how Tom Brady bought property at the Summit Club. For those of you that have never heard of the Summit Club, it would the Summit Club describes itself as Vegas's only private residential lifestyle club community. So I did a little homework. Google Maps, shout out to you. This is about how far the Summit Club is from Allegiant Stadium. It's about 19 minutes, okay? By car, 19 minutes. Now, I was like, okay, I get it. It's interesting, the fact that he bought property there. Now, here's a picture of what the Summit Club's homepage looks like. It's nice. It's definitely out of my price range. There's no doubt about that. But do you notice the amount of golf? Like, there's a lot of golf courses around. The Summit Club is also a place where you can live right next to a golf course. This might be hard for you to, like, to think about, Tom Brady enjoys playing golf. Some athletes, some competitors, believe it or not, enjoy playing golf. So this is what Tom Brady had to say on the Golf Channel. Yes, it's back in 2013, but he likes to play golf. So my dad brought me to a golf course when I was two years old, and I've been hooked ever since. Now, all these Tom Brady to the Raiders rumors, they haven't died. And I get it. If you've watched the show, you know my opinion on it. And I watch and want you to watch till the very, very end. And I'm going to let you know how many Chucky heads I'm going to give this rumor again. Now, before I rewind a little bit and just kind of talk about where all these Tom Brady rumors stem from, let me hit you with this question. Do you want Tom Brady? Type Y for yes. Type N for no. Now, if you watch this video on YouTube, I'm going to make this the pinned comment on today's show. Do you want Tom Brady to be a Raider? Type Y for yes, or you can type your N for no. So we're going to rewind, okay? Go back a little bit. Get out your VHS if you still have one. If you do, I'm sorry to hear that. So Tom Brady testing free agency. This was from NFL.com a few weeks ago. And I know that I've talked about Brady. I know I've talked about um, him coming to the Raiders. And I know this is the Raiders report. It's not the Tom Brady report. But when the biggest story around the NFL is Tom Brady and when the biggest story right now around the Raiders is Tom Brady, guess what I'm going to talk about? My job, believe it or not, is this show. So according to NFL.com, Brady has been open-minded about where he could play. This comes off from a quote from Brady because, you know, he sold his home in Brookline, Massachusetts. And when that happened, the internet blew up. So here's Tom Brady's quote. I am open-minded about the process, and at the same time, I love playing football. I want to continue to play and do a great job. I am looking to what is ahead. Whatever the future may bring, I will embrace it with open arms. Now, again, this is an older quote. I am taking you guys through some past episodes on the Raiders Report to show you that my opinion, realistically, it's not too much different. So, Tom Brady to the Raiders... You know, it's been something that we have talked about a whole, whole bunch. I will say this, though. If Tom Brady does go to the Raiders, it'll be a jersey that'll be on sale. There's no doubt about it. But if you guys want to get a jersey today, right now, I got a deal for you. 20% off today, jatsports.com slash Raiders jersey. Josh Jacobs, Max Crosby, any Raider you want, chatsports.com slash Raiders jersey. Let me know in the comment section which Raiders jerseys you already have, which ones you need. I know a guy, chatsports.com slash Raiders jerseys. Now, I saw this one come out today, okay? There was a report around, you know, Tom Brady's decision is going to come down to money. This one's from NBC Sports Boston. So according to Gary Tanguay, I don't know if I got it right or not, of NBC Sports says the decision will simply come down to money. It's because, you know, Brady's the 13th highest paid quarterback and he wants to get paid. He's sick and tired of not getting the money. My only question to anyone that has ever followed Tom Brady's career, when has money ever mattered? The dude's trying to sell his house for almost $40 million. Giselle makes a lot more money than Tom Brady. So here's Gary's quote. Well, I think he's leaving. 
Okay, Gary, cool. I didn't ask you. Cap-wise, it's impossible for Bill Belichick to keep him at the number he wants to keep him at and the number Brady wants to get paid. Tom Brady wants to win. Tom Brady's going to get paid. But for you to sit there and say that it's going to come down to money and money alone, that's laughable to me. Because it's never been about money for Tom Brady. He's got enough money in the world where, guess what? If he wants to buy a random property in Las Vegas, he can freaking do it. So where will Tom Brady play in 2020? I want you to type P for Patriots. I want you to type O for Other. I'm going to continue to type my P for Patriots. We put out a video on our main Chat Sports channel. If you get time, go check it out. YouTube.com slash Chat Sports TV. On Tom Brady's top destinations. The Patriots, number one. The Raiders, they weren't number two. If you think that it's going to be somebody else, you can type your O for Other. Be an overachiever and let me know which team you think it's going to be. Now, if you ask Dana White, UFC president, he thinks it's either going to be the Patriots or it's going to be the Raiders. Now, he said this after UFC 246 when Conor McGregor knocked out the Cowboy in basically 40 seconds. If you want to talk about another 40-second fight, I think it'd be me knocking out the Cowboys report host. Don't tell him. So, UFC president said if Brady isn't playing for New England in 2020, he'll be with the Raiders. Now, there was a picture that went viral, okay? And I love pictures. I'm all about the internet. I'm all about, you know, social media. It's great. Here's the picture. Mark Davis, Marcel Reese, and Tom Brady at UFC 246. It's, it's literally just them looking at each other, smiling, and it makes me chuckle a little bit because this picture alone, people were like, it's a done deal. Tom Brady's going to be a Raider. This picture says it all. I get the picture sometimes are worth a thousand words, but from what I've heard, they're not talking about too much in this picture. So I know I'm going to get a lot of these in the comments. And I, you know, guys, I'm on board with you. Are you sick of the Tom Brady rumors? One for yes or type two for no. For those of you that are typing your one for yes, well, how about this? I'm going to be putting out videos the entire offseason. So when somebody says that Tom Brady's going to the Raiders, you can be like, wait a minute. I heard some guy in a silver suit talk about that Tom Brady's not going to go to the Raiders. Show my channel. Let's grow the channel. This show is about taking rumors and then me debunking them, okay? That's what it's about. Make sure you subscribe, youtube.com slash Raidersport, so you don't miss anything the entire offseason. Somebody else that's sick and tired of the Tom Brady rumors, it's this guy. Maybe you've heard of him before. It's Derek Carr. And, like, I don't blame him, okay? Derek, you and me, man, we're, we're on the same page, okay? My job is to cover the stories. I've been saying since day one that you should, the Raiders should stick with Carr. And all the rumors around Tom Brady, they're BS. So Tom Brady, Mark Davis, I showed you the picture a little bit earlier. It's basically the viral photo that Derek kind of talks about when he you know, goes on to say, I'm sick and tired of these rumors. Now, Derek is normally a pretty quiet dude. And I think you can really, really tell his frustration by these quotes. I mean, there was a lot of quarterbacks at that fight. And there was a lot of football players at that fight that are free agents. And it's like every time with my job, it's always a story, no matter what. And knowing some people that were around, I even know what the conversation was between Davis and Brady. And it's like, come on, man. When is it going to end? Maybe, maybe they were talking about, hey, Mark, what's a great resort that I could potentially play golf at? Because guess what I think he was saying? Hey, I'm planning on moving. Hey, I want to be able to play golf. Where do you guys play? Maybe we can link up sometime. That's what I think the whole conversation was with Mark Davis and Tom Brady. Whew. Let me calm down and tell you about today's sponsor, BetDSI, the Internet's number one sports book. Go to chatsports.com slash bet. Use our promo code Raiders120. It's going to get you 120% deposit bonus. So if you want to bet on the Super Bowl, if you want to bet on the NBA, if you want to bet on where Tom Brady's going to play, do it at Bet the Asai. It's the Internet's number one sports book. Now, I've talked about Tom Brady to the Raiders a bunch, actually. And if you are a loyal subscriber, you'll know that this is not my first video. And you know what? It probably won't be my last. So the first time I talked about it in the new year, January 7, 2020, I gave it zero Chucky heads, tuck rule, tuck that. On January 21st, 2020, just about 10 days ago, guess what I gave it? Zero Chucky heads, tuck rule, tuck that. Today, January 30th, 2020, the day that I'm filming the show, Tom Brady to the Raiders, guess what? It is zero Chucky heads, tuck rule, 
Talk that. I want you to spread the word of the show. I want you to let people know about it. And this is my main reason, okay, why Tom Brady isn't going to be a Raider. Tom Brady destination odds. Somebody tell me what's the Raiders' new name. Okay, it's the Las Vegas Raiders. Okay, so they're plus 2,000 odds here. Perfect. Don't you think if Tom Brady was going to the Las Vegas Raiders, Las Vegas would know about it? Like, they're very good at what they do. And when I look at odds like this, with the New England Patriots at minus 3, you know, 50, with the Raiders at plus 2,000, and then there's the Panthers, the Browns, the Broncos, the Buccaneers, all the same exact odds as the Raiders. Like, the New England Patriots have the best odds at minus 3, 3, 5, and then it's the Chargers, the Colts, the Titans, the Raiders are tied for fifth. If Tom Brady was going to the Las Vegas Raiders, Las Vegas would know about it. Period. And the odds would be a whole lot better. So can we please end these Tom Brady rumors? And I appreciate everyone that has watched the video this far. I've been doing this more because I want to know the people that watch from start to finish because y'all are my diehards. So I want you to message me on Instagram at MitchellRens365. Tuck rule, tuck that. And spread this video because I am so sick and tired of the Tom Brady to the Raiders rumors. Raider Nation, what's going on? Is this the number one Raiders channel on YouTube? For Chucky Heads, believe it, baby. And if you haven't already, subscribe right here. I'm giving you Chucky Heads news, rumors, Raider Nation rumors. And look at this. I'm making your life easier. Check out my next video. Thanks for watching, and go Raiders.